Hello? Is someone there? No mask represents a hateful woman in the guise of a demon. Did you get that? Got it. We have a fire. Look for the smoke. We're on our way. Laura, you made it. Sam, oh, um, thank goodness. Surprise. It's okay. It's one of us. Sorry if I startled you. This place would make anyone a little jumpy. We just spoke to your crew. They're on their way. Look. He bandaged my foot. <laughs> oh, it was the least I could do. My manners. I'm sorry, I'm Matthias. A teacher by trade. Not really cut out for island life, I'm afraid. <laughs> Sweetie, you look exhausted. Just sit down. Yeah. Sam here was just telling me about the Sun Queen. Right, Himiko. Can you tell me more? I'm intrigued. Well, believe it or not, a couple thousand years ago, Queen Himiko pretty much ran things in Japan. <sighs> she loves telling this story. Himiko was beautiful, enigmatic, but also ruthless and powerful. Legend says she had shamanistic powers. And this is where she loses me. Well, there's always some truth to myths. She commanded an army of samurai warriors, her magnificent storm guard. They rode the very winds of the battle, laying waste to all who opposed them. They say the sun rose at Himiko's command, and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea and beyond. But what happened to you?
We need to find them. No, uh, wait, wait, wait. What about Raw? Okay, let's split up. One of us go with Lara and meet up with Raw. The rest of us should fan out and look for Sam. I'll go with her. No, no. Le uh, let me. You know how to use one of these? It's, it's been a while. It, it's all coming back to me. Get to Raw. We'll find Sam and this Matthias guy. <laughs> You gonna be okay? Yes, I probably just need to rest for a few minutes. You sit, uh, you sit here. I'll, uh, <clears throat> I'll check up ahead. Okay. Not so bad. I can't believe we're actually on an expedition to find the homeland of my ancestors. Ever since I told Lara the story of Himiko years ago, she's been hunting for its location. I never really gave it much thought that any of this could actually be real history. My grandmother used to tell me the story like it was a memory. Many thousands of years ago, Queen Himiko ruled the land of Yamatai. The sun rose at Himiko's command and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea and beyond. But one day, Yamatai simply disappeared without a trace, forgotten in time. These are fascinating. I've seen these before. Oh, they must be ritualistic. Th this female image is particularly interesting. 
Looks like it was made quite recently. It's by those islanders, no doubt. Judging by the wrecks out there, they were once like us. Survivors. <laughs> Remarkable. Yes, well, let's hope we don't become murderers, too. See if you can work the other one. <sighs> the handle's missing. Together. Oh, shit. <sighs> it won't take the fourth. I'll have to find something sturdier to turn it with. Must be something around here we can use. Incredible. This'll work. Just need a bit more. Find more. up and down to make the rigid mask express different emotions. Laura's having a crisis of confidence, so for her sake, I'll keep up a happy face. But something about this expedition has been making me nervous. I have butterflies in my stomach. As we sail closer to the Dragon's Triangle, I'm starting to feel nauseous. And this isn't the excited kind of nerves. What the hell is wrong with me? I should be excited! This trip is going to be awesome. I just need to shake off this feeling. Maybe I can convince Lara to take a break and have a drink with me.